Hello lords and ladies, Kaiser here, and welcome to the next episode of Gekokujo Danyo Edition. Now, when last we left off, I did say that I am going to do the tournaments in Kasogayama, and as you can tell by the swarm of uh, lords leaving Kasogayama, the tournaments are over. We were pretty successful, I suppose. Out of three tournaments, we won two. The one we did lose was a case of just me being jumped by four people while my team was running towards their one. We have a belligerent drunk here. I'm just gonna pull out my sword preemptively because I know... What are you looking at? I'm not sure. Some sort of animal, clearly. I'll wipe that smirk off your face! Ouch. There we go. Well, I'd say he started it. That entitles you to his sword and purse, I suppose. <laughs> wow, okay. So basically survival of the fittest, nice. Have a drink on the house, as I dare say you've saved a patron or two a broken skull. Still, I hope he still has a pulse. It's not good for an establishment to get a name as a place where men are killed. That is true. But if I wait, we just got his wakizashi. Nice. Alright, so Gensaku the innkeeper. Wasn't there somebody else here that just ran away completely? Okay, I'll just re-enter because I I recall seeing some there we go, Gonmaro the slaver. We do have some prisoners to sell. Two of them actually. Yay, 60 gold. I mean 60 mon. <laughs> But hey, we'll take anything we can get. So the plan right now, guys... Uh, I've looked around, we're... Yeah, we're gonna sell that Wakizashi. We might have been better off giving it to one of our uh, companions, but eh, what is done is done. I'm gonna recruit some volunteers here. Here we go. Uh, because the plan right now, I think, is for us to get to about 50 or 60 men. Which should give us the strength that it requires for you to not randomly get jumped by parties of like 20 monk rebels, shinano rebels, etc, etc. Which means that we will be able to start doing missions for both towns and lords. Because relationships are important, especially like for anything that we're gonna do, so... Let me just keep talking as we go for anything we do, because you have to increase your relationship with towns in order to uh, open your own uh, enterprises. And the same way you have to have good relationships with certain lords, we're just gonna go and try to attack those looters if they don't disappear on us like that. Um, since as you increase your relationship with lords, that means that they will be more and more willing to do things that you would like them to do. For instance, if I have good relationships with lords uh, within the Oda clan, once we join the Oda clan, many of them will be inclined to join us in our, I don't know, plans of attacking uh, other towns or other lords. They might be... A, willing to follow us around or simply when we ask them to agree uh, that we gain a fief because uh, as we join a clan or rather as any clan does you besiege cities and castles and when those castles are besieged or rather when the siege is finished uh, the lords of the realm gather together in order to decide who that besieged or rather who that castle that the clan has just uh, received or rather just conquered who that castle should go to and during that time if you have a good enough relationship with the other lords you can kind of you know well not persuade them but Kind of go hint hint nudge nudge how about you agree or rather how about you vote that I get the castle. I'm kind of stuck in my own troops here. Banzai! No 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 There's no way I'm letting you escape. There we go. 
Is there one more? Really? There's one more trying to escape? Come on, we have cavalry. I'm not gonna end it, I'm just gonna let my cavalry run it down, uh, them down. Yes? Wait, why was one of our cavalry here? I thought... Uh, I can't tell what color the cavalry is, actually. And as I think the green ones right now are the cavalry. There we go, we got him. So, no more looters left. We killed all 20 of them, wow. Rescued prisoners, Ronin. Do we want to take them? I mean, at this point, they would be free recruits, but I I'm not really interested in having Ronin and stuff like that in my army. The only, um... The only... How should I say them? How should I call them? Neutral? Uh... Recruits that I think I will be taking will just be peasant women so that I can uh, train them into elite onabushi and have them in my archery line. Uh, Uesugi, if I remember correctly, you go into archers, Takeda Spearman, Exxon. Oh right, we also leveled up in one of those um, tournaments, which is a very nice, nice addition to uh, this playthrough, I suppose, if that makes any sense whatsoever. Uh, I'm kind of mumbling and rambling right now. Usugi, Master Archer. Excellent, I believe that is our first. Yes, it is. Um, right, so let us level up intelligence once again. Uh, we will go into... Well, we can't really in increase any of that just yet. I will go into one level of trainer just so that the freshest of recruits that we get will automatically be getting some experience. Basically, I'll be doing exactly what we would be doing in the practice yards, training my men, but passively. So, oh, wait, I leveled up a couple of times apparently. Did I forget to level up in the last episode? Oh, wow! Okay. Okay. Um, foolish mistake. <laughs> uh, wait, that makes me reconsider things. Let's actually reset those changes. And since we have three levels, let's go into agility right now. This might be a good idea. This might be a bad idea. But I'm going to go into athletics, power draw, uh, and one point into trainer as I would have already done previously and that's a lot of points for us to put into our uh, proficient proficiencies english and we'll add some into poly arms as well so we didn't lose any men in that fight which is already a very good sign granted it's against looters looters are really the weakest of any sort of mobs hopefully we don't have to test our metal <laughs> that soon uh, Yes, we will recruit all of these excellent uh, Visit the end just to see if there are maybe Slaver no no all right Like we will be checking these as We go into every town tournaments are going to be held in Sakai Odawara and Hamamatsu. I believe two of those cities are very close to us uh, Sakai should be... No, that's Sendai. My bad. My bad. Odawara is right there, and Hamamatsu right there. Wait, where is Sakai? As a Japanese major, I am very ashamed of myself right now to not know this, but... Wait, where... Where actually is it? Odawara, Kofu, Kanazawa, Uho, Kiyosu... Sakai, there it is! There it is, the Miyoshi clan. But yeah, the closest one, I believe, is... Eh, Odawara. Alright, Odawara, you win the lottery. Not really a lottery, you win the vote, if anything. So let's go there. We just spent a lot of mm, gold to recruit those uh, samurai. But I believe in the long run, it will be worth it. Uh... And as we go through here, let's go to Ueda no Sho. I, I think we have enough samurai for now. For now. We, of course, will be training more of them later. But right now, we are going to get some uh, normal village recruits. As they are cheaper, but they still add 
to our strength. Only 10 days left of food. Oh, okay. That is... Wait, why can I not... Did we... I suppose we uh, recruited troops here not too long ago, apparently. Alright, but I don't really want to recruit any Hojo clan... Uh troops but we will head to considering the fact that we are hopefully going to uh, another tournament right now i see no harm in us right i can't recruit here maybe in ueda castle hopefully <laughs> i would like to get some takeda uh apparently not okay kofu perhaps i would like to get some takeda samurai as well because those are and always will be the superior cavalry samurai, in my eyes, at least. Hokuto, yes, we will head here as well. Uh, well, see, some troops are already... Wait, what gives? Okay. Some troops are already ready to train up. Uh, Uesugi, let me... Guys, just to make sure, because I forgot to check the troop trees since last time, but just to make sure I am not doing anything wrong... You guys are superior, city officer, guard. Right, we were going into archers with them and cavalry. The... Right, the villagers go into elite Uesugi archers. Right, right, okay. So, we will be training them into cavalry and I suppose we can have some... Uesugi, uh, horse archers as well, and the Takeda without a single doubt, yeah, Hatamoto Cavalry, um, and Elite Spearmen as far as the Hatamoto Archer. I am unsure which ones are stronger, wait, let me check this, uh, so Iron Flash 6, Strength 17, 10, 10, level 27, level 27, health, they, ha they do have more health, but the horse archers have more archery, plus they are much more elusive. Alright, so I'm pretty sure that the bulk of our cavalry will most likely be Takeda. At least for now, until we join the Oda, because once again, I'm very sorry that I'm checking this right now. But yeah, the Oda have very good cavalry as well, as well as Hatamoto gunners. Can't forget that. Okay, so these guys are apparently going on a warpath. Kofu. Why can I not recruit anything? Wow! Can't recruit there either. Uh, I know for a fact that we were not in Yoshiwara Castle yet, so if I can't recruit there, I don't know what's up. I can't! But... but why? Okay, this is getting weird, uh, and I can't recruit there because it's getting raided. Apparently the Hojo and the Takeda are at war right now, which historically isn't quite correct. Historically the Hojo and the Takeda were allies, at least until... Well, just before the Takeda's down downfall, I suppose. Uh, Odawara, let's wait until morning. Dawn, there we go. Is there still a tournament? There is not. Alright, so we missed it. Or maybe not. Yes, we did miss it. Alright, so that was a, a bit of a goose chase. Uh, a tournament is going to be held at Kumamoto. Okay, no, so we're not heading to Kumamoto. Definitely not. I'm still confused as to why I cannot recruit the Takeda troops. Or... That explains it. Alright, so we're at our cap. <laughs> that definitely explains it. Uh, uh, okay, so talking to retainer. Uh, huh. Yeah, marksman. Villager into skirmisher. All right, so we are at our cap. That explains it. Uh, I am hoping that the renown still works the same in this uh, mod. So for every, I believe, 25 renown. So we have a renown of 136. Let me check the size report. Renown 13. So... Oh, so for every 10 renown, we can have an additional troop. Okay. That's even better than what I remember. 
Very good. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so considering we are at our cap, I think we are going to... I, I don't know if this would... Uh, constitute as being a daredevil but we are going to head into Kyosu. first things first actually let's head to kakegawa uh visit the marketplace and i completely forgot to sell all of these things i mean a hundred mon is a hundred mon i won't like i won't say no to that uh they are drinking the sake okay so what is the cheapest i can have as far as food goes brown rice and normal rice all right so plus dried sea fish let's we are filling up our inventory quite a lot with food but at least this food will last us for a while plus uh the party morale bonus is sufficient so okay 50 men they will slowly be trained under me. Uh, of course, there is a limit to uh, how, I mean, to which rank they can get trained. Considering I'm only level 11. The higher my level, basically, the higher the rank they can get trained by me. Do we try to attack these monk rebels just to show you how strong they are or do we try and just go past them and into Kyosu? i think we're actually just gonna head to uh to Kiyosu. uh yeah i think that's a better idea like i i my troops are not that well trained yet though iso sangema just got a promotion or rather just leveled up which is excellent so iso sangema if i remember and remember correctly my goal with you is to have you upgrade agility and have you as our forager and looter looter yeah and forager so far level zero but we will fix that <laughs> uh, also it would probably be a good idea to have my companions get to strength 15 and an agility of at least 12 so that i can give them decent horses or at least level um, 9 agility, because level 3 riding is usually the... A good place to be as far as riding goes, because you can give them pretty fast um, horses. I believe that the only horses that require riding 4 or 5 even are like war horses. Basically the horses that you charge into people with. Which I do not think is our priority, honestly. Uh, but the strength is also good to have because uh, the more OP, if you want me to call them that. But let's just call it, it stronger. Uh, the stronger armor, the stronger weapons and such require quite a lot of strength. Uh, for now, I believe we will be increasing your... Actually, we're gonna increase intelligence to 9, because I really want to have things dividable by 3. That way, I know that nothing is being lost. So, and we will give her iron flesh, uh, sh flesh, he says, flesh, so that she survives for longer. She is an experienced archer, that is excellent. Plus, we will give her some two-handed weapon proficiency, as well as some of our men are ready to upgrade further. Excellent. Like as as you can see, the, the moment you start um, hiring samurai and training samurai up, uh, the weekly wages go up astronomically, which is why um, it's not the best of ideas to train them up immediately. You fall back from the main body. No, not my problem. I am not doing that again. Bad experiences. <laughs> Very bad experiences. Okay, so we're heading into Kyosu. Uh, we have not met the guildmaster just yet, so we have to take a walk around the streets to find him. But it shouldn't be that much of a problem to find him. Right, we still need a horse. Which is what I will do. Oh, wow, you're right at the beginning. Uh, also, why does Kyosu seem so poor? Kyosu was the Oda main city and Nobunaga's father was doing a pretty good job in using his resources well but okay uh do you happen to have a job for me 
We have heard that about a week ago, some travelers on the road to Hamamatsu were attacked by Lord Kuno's party. We would like you to track these Lord Kuno's party down. You want me to hunt down a lord? No, I'm not taking that job at the moment. I'm very, very sorry, but no, we are not going to be hunting lords down just yet. That is definitely not a good idea. Like, that is a strange addition. Like, I know that lords are attacking you, but usually, in the original Gekko Kujo, uh, you would just get asked to track down some bandits or deserters or rebels or stuff like that. Not lords. That is a completely different level of difficulty. Um, how... No, that is not what I require. Uh, and establish myself as a merchant. Well, to be honest, I think that we in the guild would like to, you to build... See, you need a stronger relationship with them. Now, you either do jobs and quests for the town, or uh, I believe that once every week or so, you can head to the inn and pay a thousand mon to pay basically every each and single person that comes to the inn that night a glass or a couple glasses of their finest sake. But we're kind of, we're not really that well off, so we're not going to be doing that. Uh, any Choshi and Funai. Choshi, 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 Choshi should be relatively close. That is not really close, is it? But neither is Funai. So what should our plan be right now? I believe that um, I would like to begin... Wait, reports? No, that's not it. My bad, my bad. This is what I wanted. Characters. So Lady Aki is the one that we are going for. Lord Takigawa. Okay, so this is the lord that we want to increase our... There he is. Increase our standing with for future... Uh, for future things. Do I know you? My name is Otto, at your service, sir. I am Lord Takigawa, a vassal of Oda Clan and the Lord of Komaki Castle. Ah yes, at last we meet. You sound like a good man to know. Let us speak together from time to time. Oh really, so my renown is already high enough to be known through the land. God, I wish I could read that, but since it's in curve... Ah. Curve style, I can't really see that well. Damn it. Okay, so, um, do you have any tasks for me? As it happens, Otto, I promised Great Lord Order that I would hire a company of Ronin. No, 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 no. We are not ready to be fighting for a lord just yet. Um, I'm not interested, thank you. Do you have anything else that I could help you with? I need to deliver a le letter to Lord Kawachi of Ashikaga Shogunate, who must be at Kanoji Castle currently. Uh, certainly. We can do that. Uh, wait, I already forgot. What is he called? <laughs> Lord Kawachi. Okay. So we have to head probably to Kyoto, or rather, where was he last seen? Uh, delivered at Kanoji Castle. Kanoji Castle. Alright, so let's head to Kanoji Castle. We will be... Uh... Okay, so they were just running from those guys. That's fine. I thought they were trying to follow me, which was a much more dangerous prospect. <laughs> I'm sorry for these maybe laggy moments, guys. It's just that um, there's so much going on that every once in a while, uh, basically almost every night, really, you get a update of everything that's going on, and it causes the game to lag just a little bit. He is not here. Uh, Lord Kawachi. Well, he's definitely not in here. Did we miss him? Like, did, did he go past us? Probably not. Maybe he's in Kyoto or something? Wait. Tsuda Harada. Well, he's of the Ashikaga Shogunate, so let's... Wait. Shogun Ashikaga Yoshiaki Morita. God damn, wait. Let me just ta try to talk to one of these guys. That is a nice hair piece. <laughs> or rather, helmet piece, sorry. My name is Otto. Perhaps you're not of gentle birth, but even a commoner, be he of sufficient valor. Okay, so he doesn't know my name just yet. Um, I wish to ask you something, the location of someone. I want to know the location of Lord Kawachi. Uh, should be 
close to Kalachi Castle. Why am I not surprised? All right, which is where? Over there. All right, so let's head there. Try and not let him pass us. Unseen. I hear fighting. Okay, so these guys were probably just fighting some villagers or something. Is that him? Yes, it is. Excellent. Do I know you? Yes, I am Tralala. Mr. Otto, I have a message for you from Lord Takigawa. Let me see. Hmm, it was good of you to bring me this, Otto. Take my seal as proof that I've received it with my thanks. You are very, very welcome. Do we attack the rebel hideout? It could have nice loot, but I don't think we're ready for that just yet. Wait, did I miss? Okay, so apparently I missed uh, the prompt to tell that would have told me that my men are ready to upgrade, especially Musashi. Okay, so you upgraded as well. I keep saying upgrade, sorry, I mean level up. Alright, so how is a samurai like you, with 220 and 240, have a strength of only 9? That is ridiculous. So yeah, we're definitely increasing that, plus giving you some power draw, and some archery, because you have a plenty in one-handed and two-handed weapons. Why am I looking down on you? Like, it looks like I'm higher and looking down on him, but I don't even have a horse or anything. Speaking of which, I forgot to buy a horse in the previous town, didn't I? Alright, uh, let's head to Nara. That's the closest town. Hopefully before dark. Thank you. Uh, horse merchant, can please go away? I actually forgot. There it is, horse. Dosanko horse. Speed 50. That's... A decent horse. Do I have the money for this? I do, but it's gonna hurt my wallet. It's gonna hurt my wallet a lot. Do we still have... No, go back. Do we still have enough to pay... We do. Okay, so we have enough to pay for one more week without earning any money. Uh, that's a dangerous prospect. <laughs> Alright, a uh, tournament is going to be held at Sendai. I mean, sure, we can keep going back and forth. Uh, I might just make a cut right here while we get to there. Or, then again, an even better idea for those of you that might still be learning what exactly to do uh, in this game. Like, I'm sure some of my viewers either never even heard of the game or are interested in learning how to play it. There we go, we have a horse now! Yay! Uh, nope, not interested. Uh, a good idea, even when you do get the information about a tournament going on, is to just go to every single city, or rather town, and check if the tournament is still going on, or if perhaps a tournament is going to be happening somewhere closer, like on your way there. It's always best to go for the closest ones, because, you know, there's always a danger of the tournaments just flat out not being there anymore when you get there. Uh, uh -huh. Which... And that is exactly what we're doing right now. See? Like, the tournament is over, which means that there is absolutely no reason for us to continue our way to uh, Sendai. Uh, so, let's head back to Kyosu and check if perhaps... Uh, considering we did... Uh, I believe, wait, did, was there a budget change? I mean, did, was there a weekly salary since the last time we were in Kyosu? Because that would usually mean that the quest that you get from the Guildmaster should have changed. Let's check if it, oh, what are you punching me? What? About the job you offered me. Okay, so the job is still the same. Uh, not good. Not good at all. Let's see, is Takigawa anywhere close? What is that? Sasa, Niwa. Is Takigawa maybe in the city? No, he's not. Alright, so let's just talk to Lord Niwa. These helmets are awesome. Wow. Okay, I'm liking this edition. The Damyo edition. Uh, I wish to ask you something. The location of someone. Then you will have to ask someone else. Really? Why do you hate me? Not hate, but... Did I do something like that? We haven't... 
helped any villagers around here yet. Meaning that he has no reason whatsoever to dislike us. Like, what? That makes no sense. Lord Maeda, you look like a normal samurai, though. That, that's kind of a bummer. Hopefully you get something cool, too, in the next patches or something. I wish to ask you something. Okay, so you don't have a negative relation with me, so I can ask you, where is Lord Takigawa? Lord Takigawa has been taken captive by his enemies. Okay, but which enemies? That would be very good to know. Did the reports say anything? Uh, characters. Lord... Uh, wait. The Oda? Oda clan? Lord Takigawa. Does it say he's lord of... He's prisoner of Takeda clan. Alright, so apparently he is the prisoner of Takeda clan. Uh... And here's another thing we can do, and we will do. See, okay, if a party of 31 monk rebels is running away from us, then that means we are well off. That is very good. Very, very good to know. If push comes to shove, guys, I will just uh, make a cut somewhere and just do two or three melee fights in a arena in order to get the weekly budget. Um... But right now, what I would like to do is check where... Wait, I, I forgot if the prisoners are also shown or not, but we will be taking a walk around the courtyard. And there should be a prison that... That, <laughs> that small shack is the prison, yes. Alright, uh, what do you want? Who is in prison? Currently, no one. Okay, so it's safe to say that the prisoner list should most likely show the lords and troops that are in prison somewhere. Ida Castle. Uh, there we go, there we go. So, prisoners. Uh, I don't see Lord Takigawa being listed as a prisoner. That is because he is taking him. <laughs> okay, so... We either follow this guy around until he sits down somewhere and leaves Lord Takigawa somewhere because you can help someone escape prison. And if you do help them escape prison, you increase the relationship with them immensely, of course, but you also increase the relationship with all of their friends. Uh, which are usually most of the lords in a uh, army. Uh, skirmisher, uh, G Samurai from Ichigo. So we said that you guys will basically be our horse archers. But I think, guys, that this episode has actually gone on for long enough. Like, I keep making these episodes way, way, way too long. Um, these guys are actually f hunting them down with 50 men. Are you crazy? Okay, so that was a suicide mission on their part. What we could also do is just straight up jump in, help uh, Lord E defeat Lord Aiki, which uh, would immediately release Lord Takigawa, but I'm pretty sure we do not get the same amount of relation uh, increase. Okay, see, now he's running away from him. Alright. So, yeah, guys, as I was saying, the last two episodes, I believe, I just completely lost track of time. And they ended up being, like, what, 35 to 40 minute long episodes. So, I think I will make a cut right here. I would like these episodes to be about 20 to 25 minutes. Um, I think that's the optimum. Uh, and, yeah, I think we've done a lot this episode. Like, not that much, but a decent amount. Uh, we've begun increasing our relationship with cer uh, our relationships with certain lords. We won some tournaments and got enough men to apparently repel uh, the rebels and other riffraff that might consider attacking us. And we have a goal now. Like my goal right now, honestly, is to track down this guy, or at least try in. A little while maybe we'll do something else right now but our ultimate goal is to try 
and find out where this guy is taking um wait lord Ike move here can I not follow just click follow him apparently not okay uh yeah I want to see where this guy takes lord Takigawa and then bust lord Takigawa out of prison that will increase our relationship immensely uh and the Oda will like us that much more and that will definitely give us a good basis for when we actually join them so yeah guys um as always, if you like what I do, please do consider leaving a like and subscribe to know when the next episode is up. Please do leave a comment down below. I do go through every each and single one of them and I do listen to what you guys have to say. Whether there are suggestions of what I should do, of what you think I did wrong or maybe should do better or whatever the case. I do appreciate every each and single one of the comments. Uh, and as always, until next time, Ad Gloriam.